After upsetting number one seed Cast Lake Bina on Tuesday, the Boston Greyhounds advanced to the Section 8A championship game for the first time in more than 30 years. Their final roadblock to a state tournament berth would be against Warren Alvarado Oslo. These two teams haven't faced each other in 15 years, and what a way to meet again. Garrett Carlene gets things going for the Greyhounds as he sinks the long three swish. Boston is up by three early. Greyhounds trying to build their lead. Mark Goss. Gets a nice bounce pass to Ryan Paulson down low for the bucket. Greyhounds are up by seven. Boston showing some defense as well. Kyle Arneson grabs the loose ball and he's off to the races. Finishes with the layup. Greyhounds are up by nine. Carling was big for Boston tonight in the first half. He had 27 on the day. Here he drives hard through traffic for the layup. And Boston is going to state for the first time in 90 years as they win by a final score of 76 to 66. In Section 7, 3A championship, Grand Rapids goes to state for the fourth year in a row defeating Hibbing tonight. And in Section 6, 2A Long Prairie Eagle also going to state winning by three over Melrose area. And in the NCAA West region, Duke beats Hampton, advances. Texas as well advances. Michigan defeats Tennessee by 30. Arizona holds off against Memphis in the East region. George Mason defeats Villanova. Ohio State Buckeyes dominate. UNC also advances. Marquette upsets Xavier tonight. Washington and Georgia tied at 28 at the half. Syracuse up 33-22 in the first half against Indiana State in the Southwest region. Notre Dame advances as well as Florida State. Kansas, number one seed advancing. Purdue beats St. Peter's, Illinois up over UNLV in the second half and Georgetown is falling to BCU at halftime. Minnesota Timberwolves are up by three against the LA Lakers in the second quarter 